Hi, this video today is about the coronavirus. Um, it's a big, that's the number one thing these days, it seems like, that and the election. <laughs> um, so I wanted to give some tips and things you can do uh, to sort of reduce the desire over the, the impulse to panic about it. Um, and also just some health things. So one of the things that uh, I do, this is really good for allergies. If you have allergies, um, I have a, a few allergies and I've been using my neti pot every morning and night. Um, I am in California, so, and I didn't bring my neti pot here. So I went to the drugstore or the, I don't just the grocery store and, um, and they had this one and it's called Neil Med, N-E-I-L-M-E-D, Neil Med. Um, here's the package. I don't know if they have this brand in California, but you can get it at the drugstore. I've been using Neti Pot pretty much since I started yoga, um, which was 25 years ago, <laughs> a long time. Um, and this one's really cool because it has um, little salt packets that are purified salt and super fine, so they dissolve really easily. Um, it's best to use uh, filtered water um, if you can. And basically, you just put the salt in the neti pot and put a little warm water, um, you know, not too warm. You'll know <laughs> if it's too warm or too cool. If it's too cool, it'll sting. If there's too much salt, um, it'll sting. These are perfect, right? These are already measured out. Usually when I'm at home, I just, I've done it for so long, I just kind of put a little bit in my hand and I, I pretty much know, but sometimes I get too much and it stinks. Um, so then I just dilute it with a little more water. But um, neti is, neti, neti, um, is a great way to, um, just clean out your nose, clean out germs and um, debris and mucus and things like that. If you have a sinus infection, it's actually not good to neti because you can just kind of move the infection through the uh, sinuses. So um, it's best to, in that case, use something like Simply Saline, which is made by Arm & Hammer. Um, it has a really um, strong sort of spout and you're just shooting it straight up and then blowing out. So um, you would do the neti pot over the sink, um, put your salt in, fill it with your warm water, and then it's got a little spout, you put it in your nose, and then pour through, again, over the sink, half, and then the other half. Okay, so that's really great, um, just to sort of stay healthy in general, just general nasal hygiene, um, but especially right now, uh, during flu season and also with COVID-19 being so um, pervasive. So, um, the other thing that's a basic good general hygiene um, practice, is using a tongue scraper. Oh, I thought it was here. Okay, so the tongue scraper, right, this is an Ayurvedic practice as well. And um, so you wanna scrape your tongue. Uh, 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 uh. I do it like 12 times. Mm -mm. Go far back. And what you're doing is scraping what the, um, in Ayurveda is called amma, which is just sort of like built up um, unnecessary kind of waste in you know on the tongue um it all gets stored in your body uh digestive system amma so we want to keep the um digestive system working as well as we can um which also of course will help our immune system um so tongue scraping uh will sort of also get sort of that to toxin the toxins off the tongue and this is great for boosting your immune system over a long period of time so I use the tongue scraper. I got this one from Amazon. They were, it was like two for $8.99, stainless steel. Um, came in a little container, it's awesome. But again, you can also find this at a drugstore. Um, Whole Foods, deep, um, deep Roots if you live in Greensboro. <laughs> um, yeah, anyway, Amazon tongue scraper. 
All right, the other thing is boost your immune system by taking the wellness formula. Again, our family has taken this for a long time. It has propolis and other um, anti kind of uh, biotic type um, herbs and supplements and also just uh, herbs and supplements that support your immune system. The wellness formula, this is capsules. They have, um, these are like pressed capsules. They have the um, sort of gel caps that are filled. They have a tincture that you can use, um, but this is also, uh, so it's great for just kind of general immunity, the wellness formula. And also if you are starting to get sick um, or starting to feel like sort of run down or tired or you might get sick, that's when to take it. You take three, uh, the two, three times a day. You wanna just try to keep it in your system. That's the thing about uh, herbs is you wanna keep them in your system um, so that they can do the work of supporting your own body in um, defending itself. So wellness formula, herbal defense complex. Um, the other thing is, of course, movement. Just, you know, keep exercising, keep the circulation flowing. Um, just any sort of like joint movement, uh, taking a walk, um, of course, doing a little yoga, um, doing little lifting weights or resistance bands, but any sort of like movement that you can do um, is going to be, of course, good for keeping your immune system uh, nurtured um, and active and um, deep breathing. So if you know Ujjayi breathing, um, that's a really good thing to practice right now uh, and all the time. But again, just to increase your lung capacity and to clean out um, any like sort of stuck mucus, um, that's that's really important. Um, if you don't know Ujjayi, just practice some deep breathing. We'll do a few right here um, if you want to join me. Um, you can close your eyes, you don't have to, but you want to try to really um, draw your diaphragm up under the ribs um, so that you're bringing the, the, the air and oxygen up all the way to the top of the lungs. So we'll um, just breathe out and then deep breath in. And out. And I'm gonna move the camera back a little bit so, or I'll move back too, a little bit so you can see. So it's different than deep breathing, belly breathing, right? That's belly breathing. Ujjayi or the, the deep um, thoracic breathing is where we draw the diaphragm in. So what's coming out more is the chest. So taking time, um, you know, in the morning, in the evening, a couple times a day to practice deep breathing, maybe three times a day, 12 breaths, something like that, um, six breaths, three breaths if you don't have much time, but you know, um, just do what you can. And anything else that you believe is going to support your immune system. So the other thing you can do to support yourself just in terms of your sort of mental um, state is um, uh, practicing some meditation. You can do mantra meditation. Um, another thing that is helpful to clear out sort of mucus and things like that, if you have allergies or um, just in general, um, is uh, mantra meditation or Brahmari breathing, right? Bumblebee breathing. So just creating some sort of vibration, um, saying anything. And, and really, as far as mantra meditation goes, you can choose any 
any word that is inspiring to you. It can be om, it can be, um, and you can hear I have um, some mucus right now because I, I have allergies. I don't have uh, the flu, but I did have the flu. So I'm really um, washing my hands a lot, <laughs> making sure that um, I stay as healthy as I can. <clears throat> okay, so Brahmari, or you can chant a mantra, you know, peace or health or um, thankfulness, thank you. Um, for my immune system. Uh, Brahmari is breathing in and then humming out. going to sort of break up mucus and, and get it moving. So then, you know, you want to cough. Of course, you can also take a uh, guaifenesin, which is what's the main ingredient in Robitussin um, that will help break up mucus. And on that note, drink plenty of water if you do that. And even if you don't, right? So just drinking lots of water. Um, lemon water is good. Um, it helps. It's, it's cleansing, but it's also hydrating. So if you add any sort of um, fruit juice or even sometimes a little salt, uh, people will do that to your water. That is what is most hydrating. Um, I just picked these from the lemon tree in the backyard, which was really fun. Okay, so yeah, I'm about to drink my lemon water for the day. And um, just uh that's about it da, 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 da. wash your hands they're saying of course that masks are not necessarily helpful unless you have the virus or suspect that you might have the virus um so that you're not um spreading it but as far as you getting it it's really best uh it's just soap and water washing your hands and staying away from big crowds so um stay healthy i'll come back on and um and uh, give some more information. Uh, so my intention is to make a, a, a video about uh, ujjayi breathing, which of course is best to learn if you don't know it um, with the help of a teacher, of an experienced um, and trained yoga teacher. Um, but I will post that, um, I, don't, I don't know when, but in the next day or two. <laughs> Okay, um, namaste.